Welcome back to Triple R. Today we have the Rewind magazine from Dollar Tree. This is a really cool magazine. I saw it on the shelf there. Had Linda Carter, Wonder Woman, some of these superheroes. So I picked up, thumbed through a little bit. I was like, okay, I gotta pick this up. It's pretty cool. So before the MCU and the saturation of all the superhero stuff we have today, there was a, I guess like a boom of superhero stuff in the 70s. So lots of TV, uh, Incredible Hulk, uh, the Legends of Superhero show, wherever it was, it was like a comedy, and then Wonder Woman, Superman movie, so I guess that would be motion picture. But this is going to deal with mostly like the stuff that was on TV, Six Million Dollar Man, Bionic Woman, Incredible Hulk, Electro Woman, and Dinah Girl. You also had Shazam, Man from Atlantis, so let's look through it here, it's pretty cool. And uh, so it's like Secrets of Isis here. I think it was a spin off of Shazam. Incredible Hulk. Steve Austin there. Six Million Dollar Man. A Mighty Mouse and Superhero Gear. I mean, Superman colors there. Yeah, these really bad Spider-Man TV movies. They're really boring. Old Sam, Wonder Woman. So this is Electra Woman and Dinah Girl. I don't think I've ever seen that. Some more Wonder Woman. Steve Austin again. These are super 70s tunes. So we had Underdog, uh, The Plastic Man, Super Friends, Strangle 85. So, yep. Yeah. Never seen these. I always liked, uh, what's it, Blue Falcon and Dynamite, Dog Wonder. I thought he had a cool, a pretty cool look. Captain Gay Man, Batman. It's really oddly drawn thing for uh that's not too bad i guess new fantastic four 78 tv guide cover there Got the wonder woman pinup some more nostalgia from magazine came from the attic uh, I remember the Superpowers line. I don't know what year that was. I'm not sure. Tarzan. Flashback to 1978. Oh, man. That's kind of cool. There's your cost of living, seventeen thousand. Room wage is two sixty-five an hour. Cost of a new home, fifty-five thousand. Oh, so, look at that food under a dollar. Pound of apples, twenty-nine cents. Cheerios, eighty. What no, sixty-nine cents. Movie ticket, two thirty-four. Mm -hmm. Got some top news here. Pop culture, Garfield, Space Invaders, Top TV, Bernard Shirley, Three's Company, Mork and Mindy, Happy Days, Angie, don't know that one, 60 Minutes, Mash, The Ropers, huh. This is a spinoff of Three's Company. On the Family and Taxi. So I'm not sure if that's an order with like Vernon Shirley or not. Does NBC not have a show on here? Doesn't look like it. Hmm. Okay, have some premieres, finales, popular movies down here. You got Grease, Superman, there's a picture of Animal House. Heaven can wait, can't, heaven can wait, every which way but loose. So 
So on Billboard Hits, 78. Shadow Dancing, Night Fever. <laughs> My Life, Staying Alive. So two BGs and Andy Gibb up there. Nice. <laughs> Speak and Spell. Let's see, re released. I saw on Target a while ago. The original TV Superman's Sheena, Queen of the Jungle. Let's see, remade into a movie. I think with Tony Roberts. It was Tony Roberts, and then another TV show. I don't know the actress's name for that TV show. Classic Batman. Greatest American Hero. Some trivia there. Street Hawk. So it goes into the Power Rangers. No, this is whatever 90s. So there's some 90s stuff in here too. Ultimate Trivia Quiz. And on the tube. Got a crossword. Puzzles. And I'll use your answers to those. Stuff like that. The Bionic Battle. So this is a really cool pickup for $1.25. So if you're a fan of this kind of stuff, superheroes in general, it's at the Dollar Tree right now. I think it's worth picking up. It's pretty cool. Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are.